Hello students, welcome to a new lesson. Today we're going to learn how to refer to objects in singular and plural. So far we know that when we refer to an object in singular we use it and we use they in the plural form. When we want to ask about something we usually ask what is it if it's singular, what are they if it's plural? The answers are it's a or an if it's a singular, if it's one object, it's a book or they are if it's plural, they are books. Remember, if you ask what is it, the answer is it is. If you un ask for about, sorry, uh, more than one object, we use the plural, and the answer is plural. But we, instead of it, we can also use this. This is used to refer to one item, item or object, objeto, that is close to you, close. See? Close, next to you, near you. So if we want to know uh, about an object that is close to us, we will ask, what is this? And the answer could be, this is an apple, or more normally, it's an apple. That is, that's the verb to be. That, we use that when we refer to one item that is far from you. You see the apple and the hand, they are not close, they are far. So if we want to know about an object which is far from us, we will ask, what's that? And the answer would be, that's an apple or it's an apple. These. These refers to two or more Items. You see, there are three apples now. And these items are close to you. You see, close. The apple and the hands, they are very close. So, if we want to know about two or more items that are close to us, the question would be, what are these? And the answer, these are apples or they're apples. Because we're talking about more than one object, we have to use the plural of the noun, apples. That's why we have the S. Those is used to refer to two or more items which are far from you. You see, the apples and the hand, they are not close, they are far. So if we want to know about one ob uh, sorry, two or more ob items or objects that are far from us, we will ask, what are those? And the answer, those are apples. They are apples. Again, it's two or more items. We use the plural in the answer, apples. Okay. So now I'm going to ask you some questions and I would like you to answer. Question. What are, what do we use? These, these, that or those? Very good. Those, because as you can see, they are far. Okay. And what are those? Those are planes. They are planes. Okay. Let's try again. Oh, what? These, that, these, those. Have you made up your minds? What's this? You see, you're holding it it's on your hand. What is this? It's a baby cat or a kitten. Okay. We want to know about the object there. What are these, that, these or those? 
one clue. R is plural, so it's going to be plural. These, they are close to you. What are these? They're socks. Okay, one more time. Oh, look, there's a mother and a child, and the mother is pointing at the sky. She wants to know about that. So what's, oh, I said the answer. What's that? Because it's far in the sky. And the answer? It's a drone. Okay. But, oh my God, you might think, these, these, they sound exactly the same to me. How, how can I see the difference? Well, they have different pronunciation. This, for the singular, sorry, has a short I. This. Whereas these has a long I. E. You see those, those two dots there? That indicates it's long. It means it's pronounced um, as if it was two eyes. These. You have to spread your lips and smile. These. Listen to the difference. This. These. This. These. Okay, let's see some more examples. On the left you have the long eye and on the right you have the short eye. Let's see the difference. Sheep. Sheep. Oveja. Sheep. And this is a ship. Ship. You see? Sheep. Ship. Barco. Okay. Bean. Aluvia. Bean. Bean. Bin. Cubo de la basura. Bin. Bean. Bin. Bean. Bin. Okay. Meal. Comida. Meal. Meal. And mill. Mill. Molino, mill, meal, mill. You see the difference? Okay, once more. Heel, heel, tacón, heel. And hill, hill, colina, hill. Okay? You see the difference? Okay then, go to page 25 in your textbook. And exercise 9. B. It says, listen and write the words in the table. Then listen again and repeat. You have the listening in the active book. But I'm going to read the words for you. You have to classify them in the table. Okay? You have to classify and say if they have a short I, E, like this, or if it has a long I as these. Okay? It is not if they are singular or plural. No. Just the sound. Okay? If they sound like this or they sound like these. Are you ready? Okay. Big. Clean. Green. Listen. Knees. Read, sister, swim, teacher, think. Okay, play repeat as many times as you need. That's all for today. Thank you. Bye-bye.